Hey, boys and girls, so glad to see you here this evening. I hope you've enjoyed just all the things that we've been doing. And uh, today we're going to do a little bit of a project, a craft project that you can do at home. So, so watch this and get ready. And I'll tell you where you can find the outline for this and everything. But it's going to remind us of something that's coming up. Do you know what the next holiday is? No, no, no. It's not Christmas, although everybody thinks it is. The next holiday is actually Thanksgiving, and I'm looking so forward to Thanksgiving. What is your favorite part of Thanksgiving? Oh yes, I like to eat. I love the big meals that we get to have, the turkey and ham and sweet potatoes and, and all the wonderful fixings that go along with that. Uh, some people like the cranberry sauce that they get, the homemade cranberry sauce that is. That's always really good. Or sometimes it's the stuffing that goes along. And some people get special stuffing that they make homemade, and it's really good. But I am so looking forward to Thanksgiving. But one thing that Thanksgiving reminds me of is that I am to be thankful. Are you thankful? What are some things that maybe you might be thankful for? Can you think of some things? Well, I brought a friend with me. His name is Tom Thankful. See him? I got him right here. And this is a craft idea that you can do at home. And I, I got this online. And you can go to teacherspayteachers.com. And you can actually go to, it's called Daily Thankful Turkey Feathers. And it will give you three different pages. One of them is the turkey body. The other one is the outline for the, the feathers. And you can print them out and you can make all different kinds of feathers. You can see I've got feathers in lots of different colors that I'm going to be using. And I'm going to, this turkey is going to help us to be thankful. Remind us of some things that we're thankful for. And on each of these feathers, it says, uh, Today I am thankful for... And then it also has a place down there to write the date. So I can write the date on there if I want. And then I just write what I'm thankful for. And, and I'll show you how to do that in just a minute. But the Bible is very clear that we are to be thankful. And who should we be thankful to? Well, we should be thankful to the Lord for all the things that He does. It says in Psalms 9.1, I will give thanks to you, Lord, with all my heart. I will tell of all your wonderful deeds. Did you hear what that said? It says, I will give thanks to the Lord with all my heart, and I will tell of your, or Lord, the Lord's, wonderful deeds in my life. I want people to know what God has done for me, how blessed I am, the many things that God has given to me and blessed me with. And I want people to know about that. But above all, I want the Lord to know I am thankful for that. So what I did was, is I put this turkey together. I cut out all the pieces and I put it together. And it tells you on there exactly how to do it. It gives you a picture of it so you can see how to do that. But then I made these little things. And what I did is I got some glue and I wrote on here things that I'm thankful for and things that I'm thankful to the Lord for. And then every day of November, I'm going to glue a new feather on here. And I've got one, two, three, four. Why? Because today, because uh, this was done to November the 4th. So I've got four on here right now. I'll have more on here later, okay? So these are here to remind me of the things I'm thankful for. So here's what you need to do. You need to go get this turkey and cut it out. Then you need to get the feathers. You need to cut them out. And you can use any color you want. There's a variety of different colors you could use to do that with, but you can make as many feathers as you want. And then, each day, write something you're thankful for. I'm thankful for Miss Rachel, which is my wife. I'm thankful for her. I'm thankful for Allison, who is my daughter. Gwen, who's my daughter. And I'm also thankful for Impact Youth Group, who the Lord allows me to spend time with each and every Wednesday, and, and on most days I get to spend time with them, and I love that. So I'm thankful for those things. So write one thing you're thankful for every day. And then put it on your turkey. Glue it on there. You can glue it on there like I did on the back, or, or you can glue it on the front, however you want to put it on there. Glue your feather onto your turkey and keep it where you can see it. Then say a prayer. 
and thank the Lord for whatever it is that you are thankful for for that day. And just tell the Lord, thank you so much for providing for me, for taking care of me, for giving me these things. They are blessings, and I'm so thankful because we need to be thankful to the Lord. Then tell others about what God has given you or what you're thankful for. And that's a wonderful part how we can share God's love with others is by telling them things that we're thankful for that they've given to us. Do you think you guys can do that? I think you can. And this is something I think you will enjoy doing and being thankful each and every day for something that God has done for you. Now, parents, sit down with your kids tonight. I tell you, why don't you go onto this website, cut this out, get it decorated. You can color it, you can decorate it, do whatever you want with it. Matter of fact, parents, you can do a thankful turkey. You can do one along with your kids and you can tell them the things that you're thankful for and how God has blessed you. And they will learn from you how to be thankful to the Lord. So you can do that with them or you guys can do just one turkey and everybody can put feathers on it. And you guys can talk about that and spend time being thankful to the Lord for the many blessings in our lives. And remember to have that special treat with them while you're doing that because they like them treats, I know. And just enjoy being thankful for the things that God has blessed us with. You know, until I see you next time, I hope that you will tell me some things that you're thankful for. Maybe next Sunday when you see me, you'll tell me some things you're thankful for. So let's pray right now and let's thank the Lord for the many blessings and give us wisdom as we fill this out and be truly thankful for the many things that He does for us. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we are thankful. You have blessed us beyond our imaginations. You have given us so many good things because you love us. And we're so thankful for that. And I pray that each one of us will stop and take time to tell you how thankful we are for everything that you do for us. We love you. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And remember, until I see you next time, be thankful to the Lord because he blesses us.